business is of course international, di ba? So ayan, kindly type 1 if you can hear me. Loud and clear ba? Ayan, loud and clear ba? Ayan. So I am Dean. I, all right, all right. Thank you, thank you. I can see sa chat box na may mga 1. So I am Dean Anthony Desera, Certified Management Accountant. And of course, I am your host for today. So to all the 68 participants, ayan, welcome to our Next Gen's Power Hour. No? So this morning, we will be learning powerful tips on how to really grow our business no? from one of our Next Gen top leaders. So we will be also hearing the inspiring success story, of course, of our top Elite Circle members. And I am happy to note, that there are already a lot of associates tuned in. No? So, 74 na tayo. And of course, we are also live on YouTube. So, if may mga associates kayo na hindi kaya sa internet sa Zoom, no? so you can send the link sa YouTube para matingnan nila. So, ayan, um, let's, start, let's start now this webinar with a prayer. So, Lord God, thank you so much for today. We praise you. We glorify you, Lord. Thank you so much, Lord, for the gift of life for this moment, Lord. Thank you so much, Lord, that we are gathered today to learn a lot and to learn, Lord, how to jumpstart our business. And Lord God, we pray that you give wisdom and knowledge, Lord, to our speakers today so that they will deliver, Lord, um, the learnings, Lord, to our associates. Lord God, we thank you. Uh, we thank you for everything. And this is all we pray, Lord. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. All right, so I'm sure everybody is excited to start. But before anything else, guys, let me share with you our house rules. Ayan, so first, open your video. Ayan, and keep your mic on mute, no? And always keep our chat appropriate. Of course, designate your workspace. Make sure, make sure that it is well lighted and has appropriate background. So if hindi naman kaya sa background nyo, you may also opt to use a virtual background. Ayan, and also, please refrain from lying down. All right. So communicate with the host through available Zoom buttons for raising hands. You can also respond yes or no, and etc. So again, guys, thank you for being on time and for dressing appropriately. Have a pen and a notebook, of course, and be in an attitude of learning. Okay, so are you excited? No, Now that we are all set, without a further ado, let us welcome our first speaker. So opening up the webinar is one of our top Elite Circle Club members a premier platinum pace setter, and a director. He is a licensed civil engineer, a structural engineer, a former, a former review center lecturer, and a project, project manager of his own design and build company. Grabe ba? Ang dami niyang nagawa before the Cezana business. Guys, ladies and gentlemen, please help me welcome Engineer Jessar John Koiko. Coach, good morning. Yon. So good morning, good morning, Coach Dane. No, so salamat, salamat po. No, pinilit po ba ako loud and clear, Coach? Yes, Coach, loud and clear. Yon. Sige po. So pasabihan na lang kito if ever na medyo choppy or lag yung line ko po ano. At ako ay nasa province. So again, no, good morning everybody. No, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Kung asan man kayo to today, no. And congratulations, di ba? Especially sa mga nasa Pilipinas. It's 10 a.m. di ba on a Wednesday. So andito ka, you're attending the training, no. Yeah. So, uh, and syempre, no, uh, I'd like to um, thank then, di ba, si Ms. Malu and Next Gen no, for uh, giving me an opportunity na makapag-share ng aling, ano, ating story, no? Yan. So, um, so in the next 15 minutes, no, guys, I hope, I hope na, ano, makapag-learn tayo together, no, and makapag-add po ko ng value sa atin uh, this morning. Ayan. So, I hope excited na kayo, no? So, kung excited po kayo, please chat nga, learn. Diba kung excited kayo mag-learn this morning? Ayan. No, and greatly appreciated po no, pag naka-open kayo ng camera. <laughs> diba? Yan. Kasi pag hindi daw nagpapakita, <laughs> wala daw pong kinikita. <laughs> Joke lang. Sige. So we can start na lang po. No? Um, uh, sige. Uh, Mag-share lang po ko ng screen. Ayan. Okay. Nakikita na po ang screen ko, uh, Coach Dane. Yes, Coach. Kita po. Ayan. Uh, yeah, medyo, medyo nasa black na part pa. Uh, ayan, okay, pero nakita na yung part. cursor nyo. Uh -oh. Okay, so yun. Thank ayan. you, thank you, no? So ayan, so let's start now. So thank you again, Coach Dino, for introducing me. Uh, yeah, I'm Jessar po. I'm a licensed civil engineer by profession. I'm specialized po sa structural design. So po, structural design engineers po, kami po yung mga nagdedictate kung gano'ng kalalaki yung poste sa bahay, yung pundasyon, mga ganun. 
no? ilang baka yung ilalagay no so that was me no two years ago iba pero currently uh, i'm doing isana full time na po no since january 2021 pero ito just like everyone else here um, isana was never part of the plan tama <laughs> diba yon so just a quick background of myself so before doing this opportunity i was employed no sa isa sa pinakamalaking structural design firm sa philippines um Siguro mga ano ng mga 80 to 90% ng structures na makikita ninyo sa Makati, sa BG or sa Ortigas, even yung an enterprise center, yung building ng office natin, it was designed and handled by the company I was employed in. So, malaking company, in short, di ba? Maraming projects, right? So, pag madaming projects, demand sa oras. So, dito ko na experience yung ano, ano visual, di ba? Papasok ka ng alas 8, pero yung labas, alas 2, alas 3 na naman din araw na no? Pasok ulit na ng alas 8. It's a repetitive thing, no? And again, guys, no, I'm not against employment talaga. And I really, really, really love my profession. Pero, um, di ba, we still have to be logical, <laughs> right? Di ba? So, yun, at the end of the day, ako din naman kasi I never saw myself na ano, uh, working talaga for someone else in the long run. So, uh, uh, last quarter ng 2019, uh, I decided to let go of the corporate world. So I considered myself no retired at the age of 24 from the corporate and started our own design and build company together with my uh, architect na brother. You know? So it's a very fulfilling thing. Di ba yung makikita mo yung renewing mo? Di ba yung kinakonstruct mo nagiging totoo na? It's very fulfilling. Although kasi um, later on, what I what I figured out, no, grabe. Grabe yun. <laughs> Grabe yung demand sa time as in. Tapos, um, eto pa, it's it's somehow yung naging experience kasi, the first project namin was at a loss. Grabe ano yun, siguro mga negative 200, negative 300. Okay, <laughs> yun yung, so wala talagang profit, no? Pero, um, so that's why, um, after yung project na yun, uh, yung idea ko, sabi ko, sige, tapusin na lang yung succeeding project, no? Tapos, by 2020, Uh, siguro mga second, third quarter ng 2020, lipad akong Singapore. Tapos stay ako doon, siguro mga four to five years. Tapos ipon lang, uwi ng Philippines, tapos alam nyo na, di ba, put up ng business, right? Pero, syempre, pandemic happened, it was derailed. Um, stop yung project, dinatuloy yung plan for Singapore. So, in short, <laughs> wala po akong source of income, <laughs> right? Di ba? So, that's when I was introduced to the business, no? by my brother then di ba si architect Jerus um so isa ako sa mga unang tinap niya syempre di ba kapatid and dahil di ba napaka supportive kong kapatid oh ayan i said no <laughs> di ba so ako po yung skeptic na kapatid right di ba tapos um it took me siguro follow up talaga no it, it, it took me two months hindi pa ako pasok sa PPPS ng kapatid ko <laughs> okay So, I uh, started May, I started August 2020. Kasi siguro lang, ano, uh, at the end of the day, you just have to ask yourself, ano ba talagang pinaglalaban natin? Diba? So, for me, that time, no, one morning, na-realize ko, I just really wanted to have flexibility in time. Na-handle ko yung oras ko, then may saktong source of income, diba? pero you could do the things that you love. Diba? So, yun. So, guys, without any presentations, no, di po ko na-presentan. Uh, without any knowledge kung paano ba talaga siya gagawin. <laughs> Pero yun, I just trust my brother, you know, I said yes. So that's the start of my Isana journey, no? That's August 6, 2020. And I'm just an average uh, Isana associate then, no? Um, first check ko was four weeks after PPPS, I hit it six week. Uh, I become builder uh, three months, 14 months director, 15 months lead circle, no? So, Kumbaga, all those uh, all those times, syempre, andyan yung try, 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 tas, pero madaming failure, right? Kasi syempre, di ba, failure is part of the success. So, yun yung maganda, di ba? Kasi we really learn from those failures, no? So, ito, for those, uh, including today, no, past 17 months experience with the business, there's just actually one word na always nag-resonate sa akin. It's yes, coach. Yun lang talaga guys, diba? since day one, di ba yun yung naririnig natin? Kasi all throughout our business, yun lang talaga yung need natin. No? So, syempre, um, uh, eto no, para at least makita ninyo yung naging progression. Like I said, I'm just an average ano, no, user and associate. Pero it's just that uh, through the guidance of our coaches and mentors, no, and syempre, you really have to decide na gagawin mo ng tama yung business mo. So, eto siya guys, no, any 13 weeks or 90 days, would really change your results. 
just have to decide na babaguhin mo siya. Alright, so I started my elite circle run kasi uh, last week ng August. So, yeah, 90 days no, and naging exponential yung result. That's the outcome of who we become. So, the main focus is should always, taglag po ba ko? Or pinag coach? Clear naman po, yun. Medyo nagkaroon ng unstable na ano Yan. So, again, no, income is just the outcome of who we become. So, the focus is, should be on the development part. Diba? We should develop ourselves, pero hindi lang sarili natin. We should develop our team as well. Okay, so yung results naman na yan is just a reflection of the teamwork. No? And I'm very grateful to this family. <laughs> diba yung strangers turn to close friends, right? For sure, nakaka-relate kayo dyan, diba? And I thank this team for the trust. Actually, siguro mga 50% ng team is mas matanda po kumpara sa akin. But I, I'm really blessed no, to have them. So, pero ito, no, kung ikaw right now, mag-isa ka ngayon. Don't worry. Patid. It's your time to develop yourself. Alright? Para to, pag dumating yung time na andyan na yung tamang tao, diba, you could guide them. We could guide them, diba, for the journey of Kizana. Alright? So, ito, no, uh, this is the, uh, these are the things na, na kumbaga, Um, mga binago ko at natutunan ko no, to hit and to bridge diba, the elite circle. So ito, no, again, this is just a reminder. Yeah, elite circle is a very good thing. Pero ito yung parati namin naririnig kay Coach Chips, no Elite circle is just a bridge that you have to cross for you to get the real goal. Alright? So easy po. Again, hindi po sa goal. No? It's just a bridge that you have to pass through. Alright? So these are the things. no So I hope makatulong ito. No? These are practical tips. So, pinakauna, guys, no, ito. It's all about the system. Alright? And we are very lucky, no, that we have a great system at NextGen. Right? The roadmap, the programs, the trainings, and even the execution of the game plan. Right? So, ito, this is the SID system. This is where, for example, kung asan ka man right now sa iyong business, no, just have to check in. Asan ka ba dyan? Tapos, tignan mo kung ano yung skills or mindset na need na ma-develop. For example, if you're a starter right now and you're trying to hit your PPTS, yan yung skills and mindset na need ma-develop. If you're bridging PPTS to TA, yan yung mindset and skills na kailangan ma-develop. No? So assess yourself, kumusta ka ba sa mga skills and mindsets na yan. Alright? No, pero ito siya. It doesn't make sense and it doesn't matter kahit gano'ng kaganda ang system ng next gen. Kung tayo, right? Wala din tayong sariling sistema. So ito siya kasi. You do not rise to the level of your goals, but you fall to the level of your system. All right? So it's all about the habits. It's all about what you do day in and day out. System is just the collection of different habit, habits no, na directed towards a goal. So ito yung uh, things talaga na binago at kumbaga pinag-investan ko talaga ng oras kasi ito lang naman talagang ginagawa natin with our business. All right? So pinakauna yung Carpe Diem. I'm not sure if you're using the Carpe concept or the Fiper concept. Pero for our team, ito po yung ginagamit namin, Carpe. This is the activity checklist to on your daily uh, daily goals na ginagawa no so connect a point retail um presentations enrolled no so dapat monitored man every single day and that's for your own uh, activity yung dm this is for the team di ba sino ide demo drill sino bibigyan ng instructions evaluate and mo motivate so right now these are the basic things na dapat ginagawa natin all right dapat ano tayo diyan religious no And syempre, second is yung monitoring part. So ito guys, no, just to remind you again, di ba, Yuzana is a business. So right now, hindi mo pa rin nadadigest na it's a business. <laughs> Ulitin ko, business po yung Yuzana ha. So wala pong business na hindi involved ang monitoring. Alright? So you have to monitor your growth, the milestones, everything else. Dapat alam mo anong nangyayari sa business mo. And check it every single day. Di ba? Pero kung right now, hindi ka pa din masyadong maalam how to do this, This is the key point. This is the gem of our business, the coaching and mentoring part. All right. So don't let a day, sorry, don't let a week, no, na hindi mo man lang nakausap yung direct coach or direct mentor mo. So it's Wednesday today kung wala pa rin, wala ka pa rin goal, di ba, pag goal set ka, or it's Wednesday, magpari-assess ka, di ba, sa uh, sinatin yung goal nung weekends. And um, work really closely with your mentor and coaches kasi sila yung may ano, best idea paano mo ma-maximize yung business mo. Alright? No? So yan, message na yung mentor coach. <laughs> di ba? <laughs> ano? And syempre ito, part din ito yung accountability partner. Is at the end of the day, 
you have to find someone na magpo-push sa to remind you of the goals and activities na kailangan mong gawin. 'Di ba? So ito siya. So right now you have ano no, you have that system na right now. And so you have to dito tayo para tayong fall short right execution. So ito ano, um ako personally ang ginagawa ko the day before gabi pa lang talaga naka-prepare ng schedule yung plans activities ko. Kasi napukot into mind yan na may gagawin ako bukas. And a lot specific time. Quality time. Maybe power, di ko alam kung ano tawag sa inyo na power hour blitz or uh, jump session. Di ko alam. Basta disciplined activity. Alright? And syempre, you have to commit to those activities. No? An execution mo. Kasi, eto siya. Um, abot talaga yung point in time na hindi ka na motivated. Syempre, yung tipong parang gagawin mo lang siya kapag feel good ka. Right? Nakaka-relate ba? So same. <laughs> di ba? Pero ito siya. You really have to commit to your goal their actions and to yourself. Kasi ito, don't expect na everyday motivated ka. This is the idea. Discipline over motivation. Because discipline will take you to places where motivation can. Alright? And ito, repetition. Mag-coach hanggang kailan ko yan gagawin. ba? Diba? So, kumbaga, ito lang siya. Gawin mo siya paulit-ulit, paulit-ulit hanggang makuha mo yung goal mo. Okay? Kasi ito, actually ako, uh, I have a fair share of it. Alright? Um, three runs to get my top apprentice. Three runs to get the elite circle run. Okay. So, ang kailangan lang, reassess yourself. Kung, paturo, uh, kung ikaw hindi mo din kaya ma-assess yung sarili mo, pa-assess ka, check ulit yung game plan. No? Kung asan ka dyan sa status. Kung consistency ba yan, nurturing ba yan, monitoring ba yan, di ba, belief ba yan, di ba? check it. And syempre, put in a burst of energy kasi ang business natin is an energy business. Alright? Diba? So, dapat naka-peak state alas 8 pa lang, alas 9 pa lang peak state yan. Diba? And pinakahuli ito, trust. Diba? You have to trust that you will be growing dito. Right? Sa ating um, progress. Kasi ito siya, diba yung parati natin naririnig with mentor natin, diba? Hindi ikaw yung magsasaksi dito, yung magiging ikaw. So, trust the system, trust the process. And ito, diba? The BTS. You have to believe trust and surrender to him no kasi 'di ba lahat naman ng na ginagawa natin it should always glorify him right so trust him na kaya andito ka ngayon 'di ba 10:17 a.m. sa Philippines nakikinig ka ng training 'di ba kasi there's a reason kung bakit andito ka because you are called for a mission all right so ito so quick na lang po ito no yan ano po bang sekreto coach 'di ba to get the the ano no the elite circle Guys, wala pong sikreta. No? It's just what? You just have to establish your system, execute and commit to it, repeat it over and over and over and over again until you get the results that you want. Put in a burst of energy and trust no? that there's a reason why you're here. Alright? So ito siya guys. No? Let's not become weary in doing good for at the proper time we will reap a harvest. And if we don't give up. Alright? Baka sa hindi ka po nag-iisa, 'di ba, na tinatakbo yung business, 'di ba? You are doing it with fun. All right. So thank you po, no. So we will be together at the top. To God be all the glory. 'Yon. Thank you po. So I hope 'yon. Ako uh, pag-learn po tayo doon. All right. Grabe. Thank you so much, Coach Jessar Jan. It, 'Yun na po yung pinaka-siksik liglig at nako, grabe. Umaapaw ng learnings po na 15 minutes, Coach uh, Jessar, no. Uh, thank you so much for sharing so much of your learnings with the team. What really stayed with me is that ano yung secret na sa word na po, no? So yung business natin is my my system tayo at the same time we have to execute that system and also in executing we have to have that commitment and pabalik-balik ya, pabalik-balik lang repetition and of course put that energy and trust in the process. Thank you so much, Coach Jesser. All right, so Yes, guys, grabe ba? Grabe ba? 15 minutes pa lang, pero grabe yung learnings talaga. And now, wait, guys, there's more, no? And now for our second and last speaker, who will teach us the essential skills to jumpstart our business? It's very timely because nasa first quarter tayo ngayon, and we will be learning all about the fundamentals of prospecting and inviting. Are you guys excited, no? So, ayan, we will be learning from one of our next-gen top leaders, And of course, a goal director. She received her degree in BS Chemistry from UP Diliman. She ranked second in Chemistry Licensure Exam and earned her PhD grabe, in Chemistry from University of Florida. She used to work as a manager 
in R&D lab in a pharma company and as a lab- laboratory director in a clinical laboratory. Currently, she is a professor, of course, in St. Luke's College of Medicine and manages her own rental properties. Guys, gold director while doing USANA part-time. Grabe ba? No? And in USANA, she is a premier platinum pay setter, an elite circle club member, and a multiple travel incentive qualifier. Next-Gen Associates, ladies and gentlemen, please help me welcome Gold Director, Dr. Charina De Silva. Hello po, Coach. Hello. Hello. Good, good morning, everyone. So, kailangan daw ng energy, sabi ni Coach Jessar Jan. So, type P sa chat box kung gusto niyong matuto ng maraming prospecting tips today. Type P, let's start the year right. Sabi nga, let's run 90 days, sabi ni mentor, mentor Nat Sunyo. Yan, P, yan, dami, grabe. So, para ma-energize din ako, no? So, let me now share my screen. Thank you very much for, the, for that participation. Yan, so, grabe, no? Siksik diglig ang ano, presentation ni Coach Di Sir John. So, tama-tama, no? Ako naman yung practical tips. So, did you, ano, screenshot all the tips ni, ano, Coach? Uh, tama-tama to. And uh, my continuation is the prospecting and inviting, no? Let's all start today prospecting kasi may mga powerful tips ako bibigay sa inyo. So, yeah. So, thank you again for inviting me. Um, Grabe, no? First, first power hour of the year. So, dapat power talaga. Kaya letter P, di ba? And so, tough times never last, but tough people do. Hindi ko na masyadong itudus sarili ko kasi thank you, uh, Sir Dane, uh, or si Coach Dane, for introducing me. Uh, this is my favorite um, quote, tough times never last, but tough people do. So, if any challenge that we will be experiencing in Yuzana, remember that we will survive kasi tough people tayo. Kaya nadito tayo sa Yusana Business. So, since pagkabata, I'm a goal-oriented person kasi I came from a poor family. Uh, farmer, farmers ang both grandparents ko at saka working student lang pareho yung mother ko at saka father. So, ang laging, ang laging tinuturo sa atin, of course, mag-aral kang mabuti pa, kasi yan lang ipapamana ko sa sa'yo, sabi ng mga parents natin, di ba? So, high school to college, uh, DOSC scholarship ako. Uh, actually, college, nung college ako, wala talaga akong pang tuition. So, I'm very fortunate na nagkaroon ako ng DOSC scholarship. So, kahit mahirap lang kami, we have a lot of books in our house and some of some of uh, these books are, kasi teacher ang mother ko and uh, she started doing film life. Uh, she was an agent of a film, of film life insurance uh, for 40 years. So, nung bata ako, exposed na talaga ako sa mga positive thinking books uh, katulad ng The Power of Positive Thinking, uh, Think and Grow Rich. I'm sure familiar kayo dyan. If you don't have copies of this, kuha kayo ng e-books. This will really help us no, propel our business kasi it's all about energy positivity para magawa natin ang Yusana business. For nothing will be impossible with God. So always think in any goal that we set I-offer natin kay God, surrender everything to God, and it will it will come true. Basta para sa atin yan. Sometimes medyo mabagal, pero mangyayari at mangyayari yan. And katulad ko, um, I've, never, I've never expected that I will be able to study in UP. Kasi uh, sabi ko nga, ano talaga, uh, uh, we, nasa low, low income bracket lang kami nung bata ako. So, um, so since... Um, Madasalin yung family ko, especially my mom. I was able to pass the exam to uh, sa Philippine Science High School. And then eventually, nakapag-UP ako. And then I was able to have my PhD scholarship in University of Florida. So lahat po yan, uh, libre, <laughs> under scholarship. So yun lang talaga. No? Pag bata pa kasi ako, I've always wanted to do something different, something really meaningful for my family and for the country. So that's why nag-PhD ako at bumalik din ako sa Pilipinas. So my uh, my PhD was in University of Florida 
Um, ito yung uh, team ko, uh, ito yung advisor si Dr. Robert Kennedy, no, pang presidente talaga advisor namin. And my my research was on cells. So while doing the research on cells, we were actually looking at the uh, what uh, what what affects the release of hormones from cells. So kasama na dyan yung insulin, mga adrenaline or adrenaline yan, lahat yan inaaral natin. And also yung uh, melanocyte stimulating hormone, yun ang pinaka-topic ko. So while doing that, uh, I was culturing cells from rats and mice. And um, from uh, that, uh, that research, alam ko na kaagad that we need to add optimum nutrients to keep the cells alive. So di ba tama ta tama talaga si Dr. Myron Wenz. Kailangan talaga optimum nutrients, optimum balanced nutrients to keep the cells alive. Ang sobrang mangha ako sa research ni Dr. Myron Wenz is uh, the, the optimum nutritional formula na na figure na figure out ng research team niya can keep the cells alive for long long period, more than 10 years. Alam niyo ba pag nagco-culture ka ng cells, mabubuhay lang siya up to 7 days. Dun sa dun sa culture media na binibili namin. So, with the with the optimum nutritional formula of Dr. Myron Wenz, super, super grabe, napakaganda nun, and it will really keep us healthy. So, uh, when I came back, I worked for a pharma company. So, lahat ng mga, uh, have you watched the uh, Usana Quality Guaranteed? So, lahat ng mga instruments na yun, <laughs> mga instruments na yun in my entire year as a chemist na na-handle ko na. So, uh, we really need, need to make sure that our products are of high quality. So, sa pharma, we were actually testing prescription drugs and uh, we test the label claim. Nadidissolve ba talaga yan? Kasi alam nyo ba, mayroon tablet in, tablet out. It just goes out sa feces. So we have to make sure na didissolve yan, na absorb ba lahat ng mga components, that all tablets have good absorption. So with our USANA products, we are assured that whatever is in the product, ang taas ng absorption. And even elderly patient, mataas ang absorption ng USANA products. Um, and then safety and stability, no toxic ingredient, very crucial yan sa any drug, uh, drug product or supplement. Pero ang USANA, very serious dyan. Alam nyo ba, ang mga ibang supplements, they don't have safety and stability studies. Ano lang sila, nagdidepend lang sila doon sa... Uh, mga previous studies ng mga ibang companies or hinahalo lang nila yung mga ingredients and then nagkakaroon lang sila ng one component na stability studies. But with USANA, lahat yan tinitest. Lahat ng components ng each product tinitest ni USANA. That is why guaranteed label claim, di ba? So after, after uh, I work for a pharma, Nagturo ako kasi I want to focus sa family. Kasi when you are in a corporate when you are in the corporate world, di ba? Talagang pagod na pagod ka. Mataas ang pay, pero pag uwi mo, wala ka ng energy for your family. So what, what, that was my experience when I was in the pharma. Kasi I was, uh, I had, I was a manager and then palaki ng palaki ng group na inahandle ko. Walang dagdag na sweldo. Active income nga, di ba? So, sino sa inyo naka-experience niyan? So, I, I, I decided to teach kasi my husband was a doctor. Um, so, kaya na, kaya na niya by that time na supportahan ng pamilya. So, as a teacher, di ba mababala ang sweldo natin. Pero first love ko talaga ang pagiging teacher. So, I started teaching and my focus was vitamins and minerals act as cofactors for enzymes. This, the enzymes are catalysts inside our body. And for the enzymes to function, kailangan po ng vitamins and minerals. That is why napaka-importante ng optimum nutrition ng ating USANA products. This allow normal cellular processes to occur inside our body. Pag deficient yan, di ba, anong mangyayari? Magkukulang yung mga processes. Magkakaroon tayo ng defective process sa ating mga cells. So, I was teaching and then unfortunately, in 2010, my husband died due to heart attack. Kasi um, nagkaroon kami ng pharma business and then uh, meron pa siyang clinic. So, he was really stressed and tired. So, that is why it is important for us to have time to relax, have optimum nutrition, di ba? Para iwas sakit. So, 
anyway, uh, in 2010, uh, I decided to become a health and wellness advocate so that uh, this will not happen again to my uh, close family and friends. So uh, because of that, no, I, I've also done herbal research and um, ano ano nga ba yung mga ingredients na mga plants na makakatulong sa health natin. And the good news for all of us, you sana you sana distributors, the the herbal ingredients uh, from plants are extracted by Yusana at nandun po ngayon siya sa mga iba-ibang tablets natin sa Yusana. Nandun siya sa Celsentials, sa Proglucamon, sa, sa Hepacil, sa Visionex. All of these natural ingredients na nilalagay ni Yusana sa mga tablets, may studies na yan. At dinagdagan pa ni Yusana ng additional clinical studies para to make sure effective yan. So, Curcumin is in Procosa, Resveratrol is in, is in our Prof C and also in our Cell Essentials. Ayan. So, um, and then in 2016, I was also hired by, uh, by a big company to start the first nutrient testing facility in ASEAN region. So, what we were promoting is uh, optimum nutrition because with optimum nutrition, we will prevent diseases just like what Dr. Myron Wentz has been promoting and advocating. So, uh, ito po yung lab, but I decided to resign last March. But when we launched it, so I was the laboratory director. We launched it. We have partnership with the DOST, the uh, FNRI, yeah, no, nasa news pa yan. And uh, I started uh, promoting sa mga doctors, medical students, that there are factors leading to inadequate micronutrients nutrients and we need to prevent this by supplementation and proper diet yeah so um ibang ano na yan, ibang lecture na yan. so anyway so let me proceed no covid pandemic came no madami tayong realization sabi ko uh, tama pa ba yung ginagawa ko uh, lumalabas ako lagi and then my parents are old na uh, paano kung ma-expose ko sila and uh, so nung nung lockdown tayo uh, before lockdown pa lang, nagkaroon pa kami ng chance ng anak ko pumunta sa Japan. And sobrang enjoy na enjoy kami sa Japan. So, nung nakita ko si Coach Micah Delid na may post about Japan, naintriga ako. Sabi ko, uh, Micah, Micah was uh, ano, college friend ko siya, magkasama kami sa dorm. So, naintriga ako. Ang ganda-ganda ng Japan, sabi ko. So, um, uh, anong, magkano na gastos mo? <laughs> Kasi I think uh, my, my son and I spent like 170000 sa one week stay namin sa Tokyo. So, um, nagulat ako. Sabi niya, friend, ako kasama yan sa aking, sa aking ano, uh, travel incentives. And then, so because of that, sino sa inyo ang na-invite sa Yusana because of travel incentives? Isa ako doon. <laughs> Kasi lakwatsera talaga ako. So, because of that, uh, uh, we started our conversation. Kaya kung kayo may mga travel incentives, make sure i-post nyo yan sa inyong Facebook at you will be able to invite more people sa business. And I decided to the, uh, to join in May 9, 2020. Ayan. Uh, and di naman talaga ako uh, nagkamali. No? This is a really big business. And I knew this is really a big business because I used to have a traditional business with my late husband. Nagkaroon kami ng pharmacy. And also, I have rental properties. So I know that with Yusana, uh, iba talaga siya. No? We don't have uh, a lot of uh, BIR permits. Ma maraming, maraming advantage in, in joining this business. And uh, because of that, no, uh, nag-focus ako sa Yusana. Uh, nag naging director ako. I finished my elite circle. And then, um, syempre, uh, pag, in every rank advancement, we look forward na natin yung susunod na step no so nag nag uh, i decided to to run no uh, mga mid of last year pa pero hindi mo na yan hindi mo naman yan makukuha kaagad-agad so yung gold run ko nag start ng uh, ng june pero actually natapos ko sa september <laughs> ayan so i became a gold director end of september so 
Don't worry, it's about the climb. Now, while we are climbing, we are learning. And those learning and experiences will make us stronger. Yan na magiging, magiging muscle natin in, in, in our rank advancement to our next, next goal. That is your uh, goal director sa akin that time. So this year, ang aking goal is maging executive goal director and eventually maging ruby director. So now let's discuss ang pinaka-topic natin, prospecting, no? But before prospect, prospecting, ano-ano kailangan nating uh, gawin? No? First, kailangan may dream board tayo. So, who among you tapos na ang dream board? Na-revisit nyo na ba ang dream board nyo for year 2022? Kung hindi pa, yan ang unang-una nyo gawin. And then, mindset and belief, kailangan. We have, we have a really, this is a big business and we really have good products. So, kailangan nasa utak natin na, that we are sharing a really good opportunity. We are sharing the health benefits of Visana. And then skills, no? how do we get the skills? No, first and foremost, no, dream board, importance of clarity of vision. Paano, paano tayo pupunta sa gusto natin puntahan kung hindi natin alam ano ba yung gusto natin sa pupuntahan natin? So, make sure you know where you want to go by uh, completing your dream board. There are seven major areas that should be included in your in your dream board. Wait lang ah. Naiintriga ako sa mga ano niyo, mga chat niyo. Pwede bang silipin ko lang sa chat? <laughs> so, um seven major areas. Business, career and finances, material possessions, travel, lifestyle, relationships. And help. So, plus spirituality and giving back. So, screenshot nyo na to. Ito yung mga elements na pwede natin isama. And of course, yung gusto natin marating na rank advancement dito sa iyo sana. Yan. So, we have to be clear with our vision. And even before I joined you sana, I've been making dream boards. At alam nyo ba, 80% nangyayari. Kasi whatever we perceive, the universe seems to align itself para ma-achieve natin yung goal natin. And of course, with a lot of prayers. Yan. Kung para sa atin yan, ibibigay ni Lord sa atin yan. And then, to get the mindset, beliefs, and the skills, we need to attend trainings, health and freedom, basic training. Ako, honestly, kahit, kahit uh, nag naging elite circle na ako, naging goal director na ako, I still keep recordings of mga basic trainings, mga NDO ng iba-ibang mentors natin. And then, Monday Hustle. We are so fortunate in our team. We have Monday Hustle. Tama-tama, lunes na lunes, to power up our, to, to increase our energy for the rest of the week. And then, prospecting and inviting training. Uh, so, uh, we have a lot of uh, Monday Hustle, uh, Monday, Monday Hustle, Uh, and also power hour na may prospecting and inviting. So make sure meron din kayo mga recorded videos niyan. Product trainings, of course. How can we share the products if we don't know anything about our products? And also how to move the products. So uh, we also have mentors na hindi pa natin na may meet talaga, di ba? So make sure we listen to Eric Kaur, Marcel Anthony Robbins, Tim, Sa Tim Salas, and then uh, Napoleon Hill, and all the other Um, powerful mentors that will help us build our business. So prospecting, no? what do we do whenever we prospect? So first, uh, we research about the, our prospect's life, career, family to gauge whether we can provide value to him or to her. And then second, prioritize our prospects based on the likelihood of becoming a business partner. So kailangan natin i-qualify din. And then third, Prepare a personal pitch for each prospect. And then uh, fourth, craft the perfect first touch and ensure you're helping, not recruiting or selling. So whenever we prospect, whenever we talk to a friend or relative na prospect natin, kailangan ang lagi natin isipin, we are here to help. We are here to add value. We are here to, uh, to share to them the benefits of USANA products and the business. And then... Uh, Iterate on your prospecting process to understand what you, you can improve. So let us let us discuss each one of these. Kasi napaka-importante ng prospecting, di ba? So first and foremost, meron ka na bang prospect list? 
remember 250 names and then we need to qualify qualify who to invite yeah so first step so we we need to uh we need to learn so once we once we uh, know we have the list of uh, the prospect list uh, and then we qualify which ones kung sino ang priority top top 20 priority natin we uh we get more information about our prospect uh ano about the family occupation recreation and motivation no i'm sure i'm sure tinuturo yan sa basic training natin and then okay we need to qualify so based on the background of our prospect uh, sa sa ating conversation with our prospect we need to determine the mint no so mint m m for motivated ba siya so piliin natin yung mga may dreams may goals and the, yung may gustong mangyari sa buhay nila Ayaw natin yung mga tatamad-tamad. Ayaw natin yung mga walang plano sa buhay. Unahin natin yung mga may plano sa buhay. Yung mga aggressive, yung mga, mga uh, alam natin, leader type, masisipag. Yan. And then, uh, those with influence, with network, alam natin marami siyang kakilala. Authority, pinakikinggan ba siya? And then, someone influential. So, ito yung prioritization. Ha? So, ito yung unahin natin sa ating prospect list. And then, May need ba siya? So, ang ating prospect ba may kailangan sa health? May kailangan bang extra income? Or mahilig ba siya mag-travel? So, maybe kailangan-kailangan nating needs na to, Kasi ito yung, this will determine how we will invite the person. Yan. And then trust. Someone who trusts you or look up to you. Um, whenever we invite somebody, uh, misa nakapasign up natin sila because of the trust of that person to us. Kasi hindi naman naintindihan yung business side sa isang, ano lang, sa isang health and freedom webinar. Eh. So, nasa trust na lang sa atin nung, nung taong ini-invite natin. So, kailangan may trust siya sa atin. So, if wala pa siyang trust, make sure na build pa yung trust while we are chatting or we are conversing with that person during the forming. And then, uh, kailangan uh, may money. No? Unahin natin yung may money, may credit card. So, so these are the things that we need to qualify. So, kami sa team namin, we have uh, this table. Uh, we qualify by Mint and Mac. Mint is money, authority, and credit card. So, kung sino yung may mas maraming check, sino yung mas maraming uh, check siya yung unahin. So, sino ang, uh, this is how we qualify, uh, who among our prospects na 250 ang uunahin. Yan. So, mint and map. And then you put, uh, so, kung may notebook kayo or may Excel file, you can use this. And then, uh, na dun sa uh, last column yung remarks. So, mga additional comments on about our prospect. Yan. Paano natin, kasi importante yung mga comments na yan in, in, um, in inviting the person. And then next, we need to prepare a personalized speech for each prospect. So we gather in-depth information on our prospects to hone our pitch or invitation and para ma-personalize siya. And then uh, how do we do this? We take a look at the prospect's FB, Instagram, TikTok, uh, lahat ng mga pwede. Uh, LinkedIn, pwede din. No? So... Uh, Maging marites tayo. <laughs> In short, no? maging marites tayo. No? Uh, I'm sorry, pero kailangan talaga sa business natin maging marites tayo sa buhay ng ating prospect. And then, identify uh, ano ba yung mga recent updates sa buhay niya para naman makarelate, makarelate siya pag nag, ano tayo, nag-uusap tayo, di ba? So, once we learn about more about our prospect's life, we need to find a reason to connect. Yeah. So, uh, kailangan na... Uh, kailangan natin makaisip ng paano nga, paano nga ba makakakonect. So mamaya, may bibigyan akong mga tips, uh, mga usual connection, uh, mga first hi, hello sa ating mga uh, prospect. So, craft the perfect first touch and ensure you're helping that selling. So, yun talaga, no? Helping. We are, I am helping, I am sharing, I am, I am uh, sharing a big business to my friend, to my relative. I am giving my relative and my friend a possibility of having this healthy, healthy lifestyle, healthy body, kahit na may COVID pandemic. So, yun lagi na, ang dapat nating isipin. 
keep it casual. Remember, this is just a conversation. So, ano lang, enjoy natin, enjoy natin yung conversation with our prospect. So, these are some of our conversation starters. So, Happy New Year! So, sino sa inyo nag-Happy New Year na sa mga prospect nyo? So, kung hindi pa, pwede pa naman kasi January pa. Tsaka hindi pa, hindi pa January 15, January 12 pa ngayon, di ba? So, you can start. Happy New Year, friend! No? Uh, happy New Year, friend! Kumusta? Anong mga plano mo this year? Yan. Happy anniversary! Happy birthday! So any any greeting will do sa ating friend and ilagay natin yun sa, sa as private message. So after nating mag-like sa kanyang sa kanyang Facebook account, sa kanyang mga post, we can we can uh we can chat dun sa kanyang uh, mag, mag PM tayo or mag DM tayo, direct message. So also we can start with a thank you. Thank you for liking my post. Thank you for posting beautiful pictures of your travel. Thank you for the advice on your page. Thank you for reminding me sa post mo. Thank you for for my, for being my friend kasi happy new year ngayon. <laughs> Ayun, gano gano. Let's start with a thank you note. Or pwede ding happy Wednesday, happy Wednesday or sa start of the week happy Monday kasi di ba gusto natin makapag-prospect pag Monday. Happy Monday, kumusta na? Happy Tuesday, yan. Then uh, you can comment na doon sa about sa family niya, about sa trabaho niya, about sa mga pinost niya. And then uh, also comment about you can also comment about your ayan, comment about your friends post about family, travel, celebration during Christmas or New Year. or new year. Alam niyo ba pag nagpo-post ang isang ano, ang isang uh, personalidad, <laughs> ano, gustong-gusto niya na may nagtatanong tungkol sa post niya. So, let's take advantage of take advantage talaga. So, let's let's uh, gawin natin tong way, no? Nag gawin nating way to uh, start a conversation with our friend or relative. Yan. So, um meron na akong ano, meron na akong napaka-powerful tips sa inyo today. This one talagang ano ginawa na namin uh, uh, ng team and uh, siguro sa akin 9 out of 10 sasagot sa sumagot sa akin. So, uh, a very effective convo lalo na ngayong pandemic. Ha happy Wednesday. Kumusta ang family? Hope everyone is healthy. Yan. Happy Wednesday. Uh, kumusta ang family? Hope everyone is healthy. Is is well healthy. <laughs> Talagang well, pwede ding wealthy, no? <laughs> hope everyone is wealthy, pwede din. Hope everyone is healthy. Yan. Sigurado sasagot yung friend mo dyan. Tapos sasabihin niya, sa'yo magkakwento siya kung anong state of the family affairs, kung uh, okay lang ba sila, or nag-positive sila. Magugulat na lang kayo na ko parang 5 out of 10 din. Parang may COVID yata sa mga tinanong ko. So, It's it's really ano no it's really alarming so it is our duty as Usana distributor to share the products of Usana and then okay so after nating uh so that is um customized conversation starters and then uh saglit lang po Narinig niyo yung sumisigaw na ano. Okay, so number five, iterate. So after natin uh, mag-prospecting, uh, i-evaluate natin no, kung effective ba yung ginawa natin. So keep notes throughout this process to assess what activities generated value for the prospecting process and which wasted time. So kailangan habang gumagaling tayo sa business na to, alam na natin kung ano yung mga conversations na powerful conversations na na de dead matayo conversations na nare-reject tayo so i-cross out na natin sila sa ating mga pitch of list of conversation starters so after each contact with a prospect we should write remarks on our our notes for next step or future reference and also self uh, self reflection how can we improve how can we improve yon So, importante na meron tayong evaluation after para gumagaling tayo, di ba? Self-evaluation. Ayan. So, napanggit kanina ni Coach G. Sarjan that kailangan natin ng power hour. So, every day, every day, we should, uh, we should um, keep a power hour sa ating schedule. So, during the power hour, post on social media relevant topics, no? 
Another topic naman kasi yan kung anong mga post natin. It can be a motivational quote. It can be uh, ngayong COVID, mga, ano, mga health tips. It can be um, anong ginagawa natin within the day or yung branding natin uh, about our uh, image. Ano bang gusto natin i-project? So, we need to be able to have a, a, an image sa ating mga mga prospect. Ano ba ang naisip nila tuwing tuwing uh, kakausapin natin sila? Ano bang naisip nila sa character natin, sa personality natin? So, make sure you have that brand or image na gusto mong i-project using social media. And then uh, also, uh, let's use the power hour uh, talking to at least 10 new people, okay? So, yung sinabi kong conversation starter, nako hindi lang 10 ang makakausap nyo ngayon today. You can actually have 10, 20 to 30 people no responding to you with that powerful conversation starter about health. And then, uh, continue, con we use this also as a time to to follow up, uh, continue conversing with your uh, prospect, and then uh, hanggang ma-invite na natin sila. So, ang crucial, ang crucial talaga sa prospecting, uh, iwa-warm up muna natin yung ating prospect. Wag, wag ka agad tayong mag invite Kasi kailangan, mag, uh, we should have that uh, relationship building ulit. No? If, if matagal na natin hindi nakakausap. Yan. So, during the power hour, increase prospect list, use social media, start making your FB and Instagram attractive. Kaya kailangan ng branding you know, sa ating sarili. Post on my day every day uh, at very powerful kung may pictures. No? Kailangan, uh, ang napansin, I'm sure marami naman sa ating mga training sinasabi, mas powerful po ang may picture kesa sa words lang. Post on your page to build curiosity on what you are doing. Just duplicate what coaches and mentors are doing. So, dito na naman dumara, uh, dito na naman natin na nagagamit ang pagkamarites natin. Actually po, ako honestly no, I I I look at the page of our mentors kasi this is a duplication business no. So tinitingnan ko pa paano sila mag-post, ano ba yung mga ano paano sila gumalaw sa kanilang social media. And I just duplicate. And if mayroon na akong post na kokopyahin, I I ask permission from our coaches and mentors kung pwede kong i-repost yung kanilang post. And then uh Positive quotes, health articles, old photos of friends. Itong old photos of friends, nako, pag pinost nyo yan, biglang marami sasagot na mga classmates nyo, mga friends, barkada nyo nung high school, nung college. And this can be a conversation starter. University photos, travel, financial literacy, benefits of working at home, about food and uh, your family. Start conversation with those who like your page. But of course, qualify first. So, yung meet and mark natin. Kasi ayaw natin sayangin ang oras natin. Lalo na ngayon, we are starting the 90 days. No? So, focus on those quality prospects. So, we just keep on doing. no. Kailangan dito, ano, uh, persistent tayo. So, sabi nga ni Napoleon Hill, patience, persistence, and perspiration make an unbeatable combination for success. So, we, we should... Keep that energy alive. Start of the day, pray, uh, listen to uh, really good uh, music, positive mood music. Listen to Yusana videos, yung mga convention natin, how, 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 how good the products are, how good the business is, network marketing uh, uh, videos. So, yan lahat can, can uh, give us the energy to start the day and to prospect and invite. Ito yung mga my fa uh, favorite inviting scripts ko. So, uh, first, uh, ano ko lang, note, make sure you have qualified and warm up your prospect before inviting. Yan. So, online project. Yan. So, screenshot nyo na lang. Um, friend, I remember... I remember you, my friend and I have an online project and expanding kasi kami. We are expanding in Australia and New Zealand. This can... Uh, this can be done part time and home based siya. Okay, so this can be uh, after after mo nang makausap siya ng one or two days. Now na warm up na siya. Uh, you can you can ano you can invite na you can invite na your friend. And uh, pwede naman hindi Australia and New Zealand, pwede US or Canada. Depende kung most likely saan mas magiging interesado yung kaibigan mo. So pag sumagot siya, friend, wow, ano yan? Kaya ba yan? 
Nandito lang naman tayo sa Pinas. So, pwede mo siyang sagutin, yes, everything is online. Naisip kita kasi masipag ka, uh, may leadership skills ka, pwede mo pang ano sabihin, kasi maganda ka, gwapo ka, mga ganun, di ba? So, uh, point out good qualities of your friend. So, pag nagtanong siya, ano ba talaga yan? So, you can... Pag may mama kulit tayo mga kaibigan, no? uh, ano, kasing kulit natin. So you can mention, uh, actually it's dropshipping like Amazon and eBay. Uh, I don't usually say Lazada or Shopee kasi pang international ang Yusana. So it's more like of Amazon and eBay. Diba? Yan. So, uh, so pag nagtanong siya, wow, wow naman, paano ba yan? Uh, you can ask, anong oras ba usually natatapos work mo? So we need to know ano bang availability ng ating ano ng ating friend. Tapos uh, after knowing the availability of our friend, sabi mo na good news, we have an online orientation tomorrow at uh, 4 p.m. and 8 p.m. Which schedule do you prefer? So always give two possible schedules sa friend mo. Kasi alam mo na eh, alam mo na kung anong availability ng friend mo. So ilagay mo um, magano ka na uh, mag-isip ka na ng schedule ng team na may presentation at ikaw available ka din at magbigay ka ng dalawang possibilities. Yan, for online project. Next, dropshipping. Friend, how are you? By any chance, would you be interested in an online opportunity? Sabi ni friend, hmm, pwede kasi work from home ako. Tapos, uh, you can say, may inopen kasi kami dropshipping global project ng sister or ng friend ko Eh, feeling ko perfect sa'yo. Grabe ang reach nito. 24 countries kasama US and Europe. And may option to do it part-time. May discussion daw bukas ang isa sa mga directors. Yan. So, sabihin ng friend mo, sige, I'm interested. So, uh, via Zoom lang naman ito. How about Friday, 4 p.m. or 8 p.m.? Limited slots lang ha. Confirm ko yung availability mo, then attend din ako. Yan. So, this is a um, device version from our mentors, no? sina mentors Arniel at Mentor Mao. So, uh, napakaganda nitong effective dropshipping uh, script. Yan. Ito rin, favorite ko rin to, extra $200 income. Naalala nyo, may isang training si Mentor Nat. Sabi niya, marami pa lang mga interesado, even empleyado na, na kikita sila ng $100 or $200 per week. So, this is our extra $200 income script. Friend, how would you like to have an extra $200 per week? Home-based ito and you can do this part-time. Basically, we do dropshipping. So if your friend responds positively, uh, you can say we have an on orientation via Zoom lang naman to. Okay, magsabi ka na ng, ano, magsabi ka na ng, uh, magsabi ka na ng date, limited slots nga lang, confirm po kung available ka, then attend din ako. So di ba, habang tumatagal, uh, parang, Yung mga ano natin, yung mga sinasabi natin, medyo generic na rin invite. Pero natitwik natin, lalo na if we know anong interest ng ating friend. Kaya very crucial ang forming. Yan. At ito na, ito na yung aking very, ano, very powerful script ngayong pandemic. Grabe, no? Ilan na ba last yesterday ang ano, uh, COVID cases? Positive. So, happy Wednesday! Kumusta ang family? Hope everyone is healthy. So, these are the additional convo that uh, pwede kong advice sa inyo. If okay ang family, ask what precautions they are doing to prevent COVID infection. If COVID infected naman, ask if they have consulted a doctor online, ano symptoms and ano no meds, ano ginagawa nila. And then, uh, you can mention, need natin ng proper diet at supplements na effective para mapabilis ang recovery and to make sure strong immune system natin. Yan. So, ang question ko sa inyo, alam niyo ba kung anong mga products natin ang pwede nating advice para strong ang immune system ng ating mga friends, no? Nakukuha yan sa mga product trainings natin. Yan. So, we can also uh, say at the end of our conversation, wow, that's good. Sabi nung doctor friend ko, kailangan natin ng proper supplements para mapabilis ang recovery at mas strengthen ang immune system natin. May tinitake ka ba? Ayan, pag sabi siya ng Centrum or other brands, sabihin mo na, uh, alam mo ba, may nabasa akong libro on nutritional supplements, nabasa ko ang baba lang ng rating ng Centrum. One ano one style lang ang Centrum. Pero, um, may mga may mga supplements tayo available sa Philippines na five star. Alam mo ba yun friend? Yan. So pwede nang mag-umpisa yung convo. Diyan sa mga uh, 
quality ng supplements. Yan. So, pag, pag matagal na kayong nag-uusap, maybe the following day or two days after, so yan, di ba napag-usapan natin ni talaga natin mag-focus ngayon sa health. May good news ako, may free webinar on the importance of nutrition para iwas sakit. Di ba yung ating webinar naman, start is on nutrition. So medyo itweak na natin ngayon ang ating mga compro with slide showing how our products can improve uh, immune system. Yan. So free ka ba tomorrow at 8 p.m.? I have three slides to serve ko na sa'yo yung isa. Yan. So guys, grabe. Ang dami may sakit ngayon. So let's all help our friends and relatives. No? Mamaya, no? talk to 20 to 30 people. Kumustahin nyo lang. I'm sure sasagot sila. So connect today, no? Uh, 15 minutes, happy Wednesday lang. So ito yung sample ng power hour, no? And uh, after that, start conversing with to the person na nag-reply. Um, alam nyo ba kung anong oras? That usually lunch break, after work, yan. Uh, mga 6 p.m. yung iba, kasi balik work from home na ba? Or yung iba, nag, ano pa? So usually after 6 p.m., yan, ma, ma, uh, madaling mag-respond ng ating mga friends. So when prospecting and conversing, show sincerity. Do not think of your uh, of your points or dollar income. We are here to share the health benefits of Yusana products. At eto na, isa pang malupit na inviting. <laughs> Pag hindi niyo talaga alam kung ano sasabihin, sabihin niyo lang, I'm working on something exciting and that uh, that may or may not be for you. Would you be open to check it out? Generic, no? Pero powerful. May mga, may mga prospect akong sumagot dyan. Yan. So, and remember, get people interested without being pushy. Build curiosity. Give them choice. Remember, sabor, no? Dapat ma-build natin yung curiosity, excitement. Uh, dapat ma-feel nila na may bigness dun sa webinar na attendan nila at may sense of urgency. Sabihin natin, we'll talk about health, no? Uh, health and nutrition para ma, ano, uh, para ma, ma, ma pa, uh, plug in natin sa ating webinar. Ayan. So with that, let me end uh, my uh, presentation with this very powerful video about our Yusana products. I think one of the most important discoveries we made in the, in the lab, in the human cell culture, was that if we grew cells in a way in which we provided them with all the essential nutrients, in the right form, in the right balance, uh, and protected those cells from toxic substances, that those cells, the very cells that make up our body, they remained healthy and free from degeneration for decades. This lesson was important for Dr. Wentz, and he pondered how best he could use his expertise in cellular nutrition to promote health. I remember that fateful day when I became aware of uh, what was available, what was being provided in the form of nutritional supplements for humans to augment nutrition to their body. And, and when I realized how inadequate it was compared to the kind of nutrition that we were supplying to ourselves uh, in culture in the laboratory, that I knew something had to be done, that I needed to do something. And uh, I guess that was the birth of USANA. Founded in 1992, USANA, which is derived from Greek and Latin and means true health, manufactures state-of-the-art nutritional supplements based on solid science and developed to provide nutrition and protection at the cellular level. Cellular nutrition, Dr. Wentz believes, is the key to health and longevity. Over the next decade, he worked in the lab and in the boardroom to build USANA into an industry leader. Wentz's focus on science begat partnerships with respected research centers around the world. One of the most fruitful relationships is with the acclaimed Linus Pauling Institute at Oregon State University. I'm very excited about this partnership because we are talking the same language, we have the same goals and the same mission, and uh, to help each other achieve that mission I think is very exciting for all of us. With my belief that nutrition 
is so important and is the answer to preserving and, and, and maintaining health that nutritional supplements had, had to be the absolute best that they could be. They had to pass the tests of bioavailability, of purity, of being in the right form, in the right concentration and ratio. Nothing could be sacrificed in developing and creating, manufacturing these products. And that's been the basis of USANA. We maximize and not diminish the power of, of the cell. Yeah, and grabe no, we maximize, not diminish the power of the cell. So kung ako sa inyo ngayon, titigil ba tayo sa pag-share? Let's continue the share the vision, to share the vision of Dr. Myron Wenz. And remember no, if you talk about it, it's a dream. If you envision, it's possible. But if you schedule it, it's real. Isama na natin sa schedule ang prospecting in and inviting. So let's go, guys. Year 2022 will be our year. Thank you very much. Yes, of course. Next gen. Let's give another round of applause no? and virtual clap to our speaker, Coach Chari. Grabe, Coach Chari. Thank you so much for for um, lending us your knowledge no? all about prospecting and inviting. And also, thank you so much for Coach Jessar kanina talking about the system and habits, uh, kung paano niya nahit yung elite circle niya. And again, speakers, thank you so much for the learnings and powerful insights na binigay niyo po, uh, na shinare niyo po today. No? And ayan, we have been truly inspired, inspired talaga. So pinaka-key learning ko lang uh, sa first speaker ni Coach Jessar is all about the habits sa business natin. We're very lucky kasi may system na po yung business natin. And of course, kay Coach Chari, di ba, aside from prospecting and inviting, it's all about the, the quality of our products. And guys, maging marites po tayo sa pagpo-prospect. Dapat aware po tayo sa quality ng prospects natin. Again, thank you so much. no And